on this National Science Day, the theme was women in science. And you, in a way, have made history by speaking at the plenary hall of the Vigyan Bhavan. Uh, any message for women in science? The President of India said only 15% of the workforce in India is from uh, the gender women. I think women don't believe in themselves, don't believe in their capability as much as they should. So if I have a message for women, it is to believe in yourself and to put yourself forward for positions of leadership. Too frequently we don't do that, but we can lead and we will. You are a living example of leadership. I certainly hope so and I hope to do more in the future. More than that, you also gave us the rotavirus vaccine and, and to come from a stable, from, from your expertise, I think women should be very proud in India. So it, the rotavirus vaccine is not my story alone. I am a rotavirus researcher. I did a little bit on the rotavirus vaccine, but it was really Dr. Bhan's leadership that led to the first rotavirus vaccine being made. There is now a second one made in India to which I also contributed. But no vaccine is made by one person alone. It's always a team. All of science is teamwork. Any message for young women who want to join science? It's just so much fun to do. You won't understand how happy it can make you to frame a question and solve it yourself till you actually do it. So come and join us. So that was Dr. Kang when she made history by speaking at the plenary hall of the Vigyan Bhavan, which is India's landmark conference hall. And she spoke of two important things, women in science and also this new threat called infodemics. In New Delhi, Palav Bagla.